Ingram Grove Fly Paw. Beautiful yellow fin. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous yellow fin. What's up? Troll Hard, the Nomad, GTX Minnow 140. You didn't see the dodo hit? It's on jump, right? Yeah! Look at the blue lips. Good morning, good morning. It's your buddy Mikey here, SD Fishing Sips, and the one and only Captain Nall. What's going on, guys? It's Tuesday, September 12, 2023. We're coming out of Freedom Boat Club, San Diego Bay. We got the trollers set up. We got the live bait we're trying to figure out right now because the live well was overflowing. So we're gonna make our way fast out here try to clear the live well so that we can get live bait because drain, yeah because yeah, the the fish are on the nine mile bank they've been seen on the nine mile bank and they've been biting live bait well in addition to foamers right foamers out there yeah live well you never really know what you're gonna get but either way we're prepared we got the mad max the pink mad max ready to troll nom has got his surface iron ready to go over there i i got a ghost pop Ready to go. Good live bait, 35 pound test. That's what you're going with for the live bait. Yeah, small yeah. circle hook. Small circle hook. We're coming in September fishing here. Got the halibut yesterday, fishing the solo skiff in the bay. And it's beautiful time of the year. If you haven't already, smash that subscribe, pound that like, check out channel memberships, Amazon storefront, or even buy a solo skiff for me. California skiffs at gmail.com, hit me up. Get the dream going. Fish hard, troll hard. Let's get it. Next stop. See if we Hook can up. See. <laughs> Let's get them. Showtime. You want to turn on the live well? Yeah, I got bad for a second. You ready? Yeah. Hang tight. Yeah, it's the new. This one's got a bigger motor. Yeah, that's not bad. I'll get almost two miles a gallon. Yeah. Cruising at 20, 22 miles an hour. Yeah. That big motor, that SHO Yamaha. Did you see what size that is? 300 horsepower, 250. All right, let's see what's going on with the bay barge. The live well's not overflowing. Yeah, we barely got that. Yeah, it overflowing. There it goes. Yeah. What's it doing now? No, but the live well went down. Yeah. You see it now? Yeah, because I turned it off. Oh, I gotcha. Yeah, I turned it off. Yeah, it off. Something internally. All right, yeah, you want to just go no live yeah, bait? Yeah, That's yeah, what it's going to be all I'm artificial sure. today. Mm -hmm. All right, that's how it goes sometimes. You know, you got to deal with the conditions, right, Nom? Yeah. Make the most of it, so we're just going to head out we're to the zone. To no, no, we're going to fish. We're going to fish hard, troll hard. Yeah, kill the live well. All right, next stop, upper nine mile. Let's get them. Let's go, send it. Yeah, yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. It's a nice zone. We're out here. We got a nice zone. We're about five miles outside the upper nine and we got bait balls right here. There's a couple birds on it. Are they going up? What's going on? It's just bait? Look at the inside. 
Get ready to cast into it. Yep. Get all the rods out of the way. This is gonna be fast. Get a good cast on him? No, because I'm getting everything out of the okay. way, like you yeah, said. Yeah. Right? Let it sink for a while. my boy. Let it sink for a while. Yeah, like 10 seconds. Mackerel. Yeah. I feel like a mackerel just hit it. Nice. Damn you one, this is LCU 1681. Copy all. I'm gonna try the cold cipher and the surface iron. Bring it out. All right, now I'm sees a patty. Right on the edge of the nine. On the edge of the nine. We're battling some rough conditions. We saw some bait balls on the way out. And now we're gonna fish this patty. nom has got the TP. I got the cold sniper. Oh, nice looking patty. Beautiful patty with the birds on it. Seals on this patty. Nothing on the meter, huh? Yeah, I did. Keep moving? No, I'm trying. I haven't seen the seals like that laying in the kelp. Have you seen that? Yeah. I feel like he's gonna be following us. Your lure? I thought I saw something. I think his cargo ship come flying in. Right now. on the patty. Oh, feed up oil. Feed up oil. Searching. Check out this boat that's coming through. Research boat. All right, we're coming into the zone. We're gonna throw the bat mask out. Go hard. up on the bow right there. I haven't seen any blow ups yet. We're in the zone though, we're trolling the Mad Max. Nom's got his out on the Talica. Talica 20 on the PCH rod, I got mine on the Avid EX30 Seeker rod. Guys chumming like crazy on the back. Yeah, the deckhand, he's chumming, you see him? That's how they got all the birds going, deckhand throwing a bunch of chum. Man, I wish we had my bait. Winding the trollers, we're gonna start digging. 
Dude, it's better to work the something down low until we see stuff blow off, right? Yeah. I'm gonna do that 80 gram cold sniper. Okay. I mean 80 gram flat ball. Flat ball, blow off. Where? Over Off the, the boat. boat? Yeah. One bird back behind us. Yeah. They went by us. Meter mark down low. Drop now. Yeah. How deep? 80. What like oh. Oh, they're gapping one on the back. Yeah, I got a 60 gram cold sniper, Daiwa Zipan, and the mint scrambled egg. What is that, the Top Gun 80 up here? They got double hookup. Bow and stern on Grande. Yeah, another one. Quadruple now. Wow, quadruple hookup? Yeah. I see three on the back and one on the front. Oh, there's foamers off their bow. Off their starboard side. Right, it's coming. I think it's coming towards us. Come on, watch. Yeah, no, no bait makes it really hard, but we, uh, we're gonna get them. We just gotta work for it. Yeah. All right, we got a Thunderbird here now. I thought they were up in Newport Beach, Davies Locker, but they're down here off of La Jolla fishing. Yeah. They're hooking up. I see somebody on the bow. Here's a patty right here. I'm gonna cast at it. You're gaffing another one on Grande. Move it. No. Change the lures. Yeah. What are you putting on? Yeah. Thunderbird going hard right now. No, there's a guy hooked up on the stern right now. I switched it up, put on the mega bait glow. Oh yeah! Boils right here. Thunderbird going hard. Blow ups all around the boat. We don't have fly bait. What's that? Are you throwing the flat ball? Oh yeah. Yeah. That's 80 gram, yeah. Looks like they're gaffing one on the front. Maybe he's coming around. Nice, no, I'm, no, I'm gone. On that, I gave him an 80 gram flat ball. How deep are you? I don't even know, bro. I can nice, good job, no. On the retrieve? Yeah. It's got tight on me. Oh my god, it's a big boy, bro. Nice. I'm gonna switch off to my other reel then if it's a bigger fish. Yeah. Flat ball too. Oh yeah, boy. Not away, Nom. LPN. Nom's on. Tied on 80 gram glow flat fall that JR hooked me up with. Next thing you know, he's tight. You getting line back on him? Yeah, I gotta slowly gain on him. I think because I'm so deep, so I lost a lot of line. Gotcha. I gain on him though. Coming up. 
Do you want me to be ready? Not yet. I can jig some more? Yeah, go ahead. You got some videos? Oh, yeah. Oh, boy! Where? Right behind the boat. Go surface something. You know, I looked at the meter, I'm like, your fish are deep. So I just dropped it hella down and just start whipping it. Good old flat ball, bro. All reliable, huh? Very reliable. 80 grams, too. Oh, boil, yeah, the boy will be on the boat. You ready? Yeah. Okay. Where's he at? Right here? There he is. Doing it here on Freedom Boat Club, no one's getting them. Great fish, bro. Beautiful yellow fin, look at that. Absolutely gorgeous yellow fin. <laughs> Our, no live bait needed. Yep, no live bait needed. NLB Ed. Get another on. one, good job, bro. Yeah. yeah. But you, like you said, let it go for a really long yeah. time down. I can't believe it. How was your bike? You saw the run? He was burning my bro. I had my drive pretty tight too. He did like three good runs and then he did that higher. Going squid tracks. Even though he just got bit on the flat fall. You still want to try the squid tracks? Yep. It's got a smell on it. Guess we don't have bait, so let's see if this works. Tuna on the squid tracks. Yeah, the tuna are down like 20, 30, maybe 50, sometimes 80 feet right now, so they're right around there. So let's see if we can get this down there. And uh, we're going to try dead sticking it first. Kind of imitate a. Uh, this guy's still squid. bendo. Yeah. It's definitely they got the live bait. Either, Not yeah. right now, but I just saw some a little while ago. What's that? They just got a double hookup? Yeah. Dang, we need live bait. Yeah. Can't do anything now, though. All right, we're going to move around a little bit. So yeah, yeah, I'm going to... Yeah, gonna... What's that? I got it for you right here. Yeah. I'm going to put this orange daisy chain that Nom's got with the bird on the top. 
Okay, four weeks back, we're gonna put it, it's got the bird up top, orange bird, and all these orange squid with the stinger. It's on the go back there. That bird moves nice. The Nomad DTX Minnow 140. Deep diving more. 30 feet. Four or five whips back. Guy hooked up right here. What? Guy on the front of the boat hooked up. Double troll hard. From how it was jumping, it looked like Dorado. Okay. Here, let me see it. Got the hookup on the DTX Minnow, putting it out, like I said. Nom was just questioning, and then as I was bringing it in, I felt it hit it. Yeah, you didn't see jump. the Dodo hit it? Yeah, I saw him jump. You saw him jump, right? Yeah. The Dodo? Yeah, pounds. Bounce it? Yeah, yeah, 100 pounds. There we go. Next up on the troll, getting one on the troll, we got the Dodo. And the Nomad. Yeah! Look at the blue lips. Nice! <laughs> that was sick, bro! Yeah. Doing pretty good here, guys, with no bait. Yeah, that's right, no bait. That was funny. I know. That's why it wasn't swimming, right? It's because there was a fish on it, yeah. right? <laughs> yeah. Well. DTX Minnow works for the Dodos. Now you know. You jigging? Yep. Can you turn on the rinse down? What do you want to do? Bring in the trollers and jig? Here's Sea Watch right here. I don't see anybody, Bendo. Uh, anything on the meter? No, not yet. I don't see anything on it. Fishing with the Pac Queen, Pacific Queen here. Is that intrepid down there? Big boat coming through? Intrepid out here. Everybody going hard. Yeah. Dead sticking it? Yeah. Oh, they're gonna keep moving. I just heard the captain, Pacific Queen. He said, wind it up, Nom. Really? Are we gonna wind it up? No, fine. 
Is that fish on the meter or just clutter? No, it's a uh, red. Yeah. Oh, I gotcha. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> A cloud, that's how they drive. Everywhere they go, but I think it helps them catch fish. I'm telling you, bro, they always catch fish. You thought I was lying, huh? <laughs> that's how it, you could always tell Pat Queen because of the black smoke. That's going to do it. That's it. That's all for out here. Off of La Jolla. Where we got. Now I'm hooked up this morning. On BAM. Beautiful yellowfin tuna. He got it on this 80 gram glow. Flat fall. JR hooked me up with this. Thank you JR. I got it on right now. I didn't get any hookups on the jig, but I did manage, I put out the DTX Minnow 140 right there on the Abbott. And Nom said it was swimming wrong, the lure, but got that little Dorado, smashed it. So we're thankful for fish. We got some fish and it's not over yet. We're gonna make our way back. We're gonna go by the nine. There's La Jolla there and see if we get troll on the mad max i just heard a guy on the radio say that he got a uh, double hookup on spreader bars so thank you all for watching follow along but it's not over yet we're gonna get him on the nine let's go send it let's go last shot we're trolling the mad max by these birds somewhere it's gonna be later in the day three o'clock 30. Let's get him. Troll hard to the bitter end. Bitter end. Tell Patty. Dom was watching those birds. And all of a sudden the fish came up. back.